its decision to discount the returns of individual investors through its domestic debt exchange program could be met with some stiff resistance. Three businesses learning that some individual investors with very huge exposure to government bonds and securities are considering taking legal action against the government's attempt to deprive them of their interest. Now, the government of Ghana announced that individual bondholders will now be included in the debt exchange program after it exempted pension funds from the debt restructuring exercise. Government in its revised debt exchange program is proposing to swap the existing bonds with 12 new bonds, one maturing each year starting January 2027 and ending January 2038 with discounted coupon rates of 0%, 5% and 10%. If the legal option is pursued, this could derail the government's efforts at, uh, and further pro prolong Ghana's attainment of an IMF deal.